Hello, fellow star seeds. I am Julie Joy, your servant to the light, with another message for you today from the Ninth Dimensional Arcturian Council, as channeled by Daniel Scranton for August 7th, 2024. And the title of this message is The Lion's Gate Energies Are Here. Now, ET Contact. How exciting. And they begin greetings. We are the Arcturian Council. We are pleased to connect with all of you. We are looking forward to seeing what humanity does with these Lion's Gate energies. As we know that so many of you are very interested in extraterrestrial contact for yourselves as individuals. We also understand that there are many ways to have a first contact experience for you. Daniel has his own story of how it first occurred for him, and perhaps many of you have heard that story. There are experiences that you can have with ETs that ready you for the physical face-to-face -face contact that we know you all desire. Using the energies of the Lion's Gate, you can open up your own personal portals and receive more psychic, telepathic communication. You can slip more easily into the channeling state you can receive more of the love and the downloads, the activations and upgrades coming from your own galactic teams. You can begin expressing in ways you've never expressed before, such as through artistic expression, through music, song, dance. There are many ways in which the energies of the galaxy can flow to you and through you. And we suggest that you think about all of them in relationship to what you want for a contact experience. Remember that UFO sightings or UAP sightings are also types of contact experiences and that those ships in the sky know when you are looking at them. The beings on board those ships are registering your responses to them as well. All ET beings are contemplating at this time humanity's readiness for contact as a collective and they are also registering your readiness as an individual for a contact experience. And if you are thinking very logically and practically about your face-to-face -face physical encounter and wonder how the ship would even land given the amount of space you have around you, let go of those ideas. The ET beings can also utilize these portals to come get you in their physical bodies and do not need to land a spaceship. We have so many technologies to assist them in contacting you, and many of you have been on board ships yourselves. One of the other tricks that you can now employ to bring about a contact experience that you can remember is to see if you can remember the contact experiences that you have already had but have forgotten. Remember, a lot of the energies that you experience in a contact moment will be too much for your body and or the mind, and that is the reason for the forgetting. It is not because they do not wish you to remember, and it's not because some agency of the government is forcing you to forget either. When you are ready, you will have your contact experience, and these energies of the Lion's Gate are helping to expedite that process. Lean into them feel into them, and experience what you want to experience with your extraterrestrial friends. We are the Arcturian Council, and we have enjoyed connecting with you. Now, I'm pretty sure I've mentioned this to you before, but I know every single night I go somewhere, I work with people on various projects. It's kind of the the background of the venues kind of fuzzy. I don't get specific crystal clear memories at all. But I always wake up exhausted in the morning and I know I was working with someone somewhere every night. That's just me. This amazing message was channeled by Daniel Scranton. His own website is danielscranton.com. Please stop by there and see everything Daniel has to offer. Also, if you would like to watch Daniel actually channel the Arcturian Council, you can do so right on his own YouTube channel, which is, again, simply his name, Daniel Scranton. I will be able to post the words to this message below in the Show More section. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, and it always brings me such joy and pleasure to bring these remarkable messages, especially on such an exciting topic as this one today. And please don't forget to create a great day.